Hello everybody, my name is Maria Shiweda. I am Maria the Prophet. In today's episode is a continuation of the last episode. I am still talking about the generals, the entities of God. I am talking about the new generation of prophets and prophetesses of the Synagogue Church of All Nations. I mean Prophet Racine, Prophet Chris, Prophetess Yinka, Prophetess Angela, Prophetess Anne. These are the people I'm talking about. In the last episode, and I'm going to put the link in, in, in the description here, I talked about who they are. I went behind the scene backstage, if, if you would, in the spiritual about who these people are. And I have request was on my knees, tap in their anointing. These are the entities of God. But in today's episode, I am talking about a meeting that was held. It was after June 5th. It was, there was a meeting that was held in between there, between June and August. This meeting was held to discuss how to wipe these prophets off. I was wide awake. They came, I was in the middle of something else, and then... I was tuned into a meeting. What I was hearing, I was I was shocked. The meeting was discussing how to wipe these prophets off of planet Earth. And the thing about it was, as I listened in, it came to a point they're like the argument was like there was no way for the world to wipe these prophets off because they did not understand the kind of power they were using. They could not build anything against that the kind of power they, they had, they have in operation. The discussion just went on like, now what's going to happen? So we just have to leave? Yes. But at that time, I wasn't smiling like this. <laughs> I am smiling now. But when I heard that news, my anger just shot in one shot skyrocketed and i started fighting right then because these the prophets their their spirits were still praying for me live there's something that is going on that is on the ground at that time and they tried to hold this meeting while the people are busy over there nobody would see them but when it comes to the things of the synagogue church of all nations this is the church that prayed for me i just get to know i don't have to ask but i just get that information it comes and again it's, it's not just scorn the well of information was just opened ever since i found the synagogue church of all nations that, that that's that but uh yeah they, they, there was that meeting, that shocking meeting, got me to understand something. Because all these years, I've been under attack. And um, one, I accepted because, well, my body was a training tool. And I accepted that to fight through. And then treats kept me alive, really. Like, they kept me going. But I came to understand something. You don't have to do anything wrong to anybody for anybody to fight you. Because I'm watching this meeting, I'm listening in, I'm tuned in and have to hear the words myself. They wanted to wipe off the prophets. But I am here to tell you, tap in the anointing of those people. If you hate them, whether you hate them or you maybe might not like them, do this. Like their anointing right like the anointing enough to tap into it for yourself think about that anointing as money take it get it <sighs> i don't even know how to say it but find it somewhere in within you in your heart in your mind somewhere let yourself come to that decision of tapping in that anointing for yourself there's immunity on their anointing total immunity on their anointing and that's what god had to do the video in this description that video that i put out about them yesterday i mentioned something about immunity this means uh like these are not people you go and fight anymore like they are above the fighting level they have responsibilities their responsibilities are bigger than than the normal fight that used to be going on from the enemy of the kingdom of god they have responsibilities 
So whether you are a pastor or just a normal person, tap in their anointing. That is my recommendation. That is my advice. I don't really advise or usually I don't tell people what to do and I'm not trying to tell you what to do here. It will help you tap in their anointing. So, and yeah, in this video, I just really wanted to share with you that there was that meeting that went on and uh, it's just kind of shocking what goes on. There's so much going on out there. So I was just filling you in. Thank you again for watching. My name is Maria Shiweda. I am Maria the Prophet.